Before his Star Wars fame, Thomas G. Smith was here in southern Wisconsin in the late 1960s making a film about the Markham Dairy Farm near Whitewater. Smith had the family's young son, Dale Markham, narrate one of the pieces. Well, Dale grew up to be a professional football player and spent a short time with the Green Bay Packers. Here's Dale as a boy. This is Whitewater, our town. We do most of our shopping here. And this is a town where I'll go to high school when I'm older. There's supposed to be a package for me at the post office. I don't get packages very often. I wonder if it's a birthday present from Uncle Fred in the city. He always sends us nice things. Package for Dale Markham. Hey, Dad, it's a present from Uncle Fred. Okay, let's go. I guess everybody likes birthday parties, but I think they're extra good when Mom bakes one of her cakes and Grandpa fixes homemade ice cream. This is the time of year that we choose our summer farm project in 4-H Club. This meeting of the LaGrange 4-H Club will now come to order. Uh, our business at hand tonight will be uh, selecting projects for some of you younger members that have had trouble selecting your projects. Now, I've got here a list of some of the projects that you can take. Uh, you younger boys that live on dairy farms will probably be taking the dairy project. Now, I'd like to find out what some of you members are taking this year, so I'll just call off some names and when you respond with what you're taking. Let's we'll start with Ray, with Ray. What are you taking this year? Gardening. Uh, what have you done with it so far? Well, so far I've only started planting it and putting in the walks. What what have you planted? Well, I'm starting on my radishes and um, broccoli. Uh, what do you plan to put in? What besides this? Oh, uh, some sweet corn and things like that. Okay. Uh, Donna, what are you going to be taking this year? I'm taking knitting and clothing. Uh, what will you be doing in your clothing project? Well, I've made this dress and I'm going to make another dress for the fair. Uh, what about you, Dale? Last time I talked to you, you didn't have a project lined up. Have you got anything now? Yeah, Dad said next um, calf that Bonnie has, that I could have it. So for a first year member, to have a heifer calf is, is a real good project. Good luck on your heifer then. Every year, we plant the vegetable garden next to the barn. Pam's going to keep a record of the garden for 4-H. Sweet corn is one of my favorite vegetables. It's easy to plant, too. If we plant enough, we'll have fresh corn from the garden all summer long. Right now, Dad's getting ready to plant his corn in the field. Lots of people think that field corn is just the same as sweet corn, but that's not so. 
The corn my dad plants is mainly for cows and pigs to eat. The tractor pulls a four-row planter that not only plants seeds, but puts fertilizer in the ground at the same time. If the seeds are planted right with enough fertilizer and rain, in the next three weeks, they'll grow into beautiful green plants. I hear Bonnie out in the barn. I think she's in the calf. Okay, she might be. I'll go out and check on her. Come on. Get up there. Come on. That's it. There we go. Let me take the picture. Well, that's the end of my story. But I've saved some pictures that might help you to remember some of the things you've seen on the farm in the spring. Maybe if you look closely, you can tell your own story about a farm family in the spring.